Boogie. Well, hello, everybody. How is it going on this lovely day? <laughs> Why don't you know on these trees out here? Come chew your cud. Get rid of some of these weeds in my way. <laughs> I'm trying to get a view. I got a view for a second. Ooh, red wasp. <sighs> Butthead. Okay. I think I'm good now. <laughs> oh, okay, I think I'm good now. I think I will not throw out too today. <laughs> Butthead. Maybe I ought to nickname you and Larry be with some Butthead. No. No, you would abuse my head move right now. <laughs> Heck, this is just the easy part of the driveway, dude. You're like talking and you're like, hey, everyone. And there's nobody, like, nobody there. It's just schedule, like, oh, I have to hit the light, the go button, the go light. <laughs> 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 you could make it me. <laughs> oh, you kill me, dude. You kill me today. Extremely hard. Stay oh. safe. What you doing? Oh, God. Dude, you kill me today. Hello, everyone in the chat. Thank you, everybody. In there. Hope you guys all get a laugh. Hello, Psycho Squatch. Can you guys put a beautiful and by head move, Psycho Squatch? I'm uh, <laughs> needs my paranormal crew. <laughs> so thank you, Squatch. So she sent me a, she sent me the 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 link right, and so I jump on like, hey, I'm in the back on the back panel, right, backstage. So she brings me up, right. We're talking, and she's like, hey, everyone, how's everyone doing? I, I look down, and go, ah, oh, beauty. Uh it still says schedule on there. She goes, oh, I forgot to hit the, hit the go live button. That might help. Oh, my God. I was cracking up so hard. Oh, my God. She forgot to hit the go live button. Beavis the bad boo. I swear to God, it was the beavis and bad boo. Oh, my God. Oh, y'all see what I'm approaching? <laughs> Hold up, Frank. Hang on a moment, please, Frank. I need to, uh, I feel it. I've, I've got to take a knee and, and say a little prayer. Uh, I'm feeling it. As you notice the little rock that I'm starting to get. And so, uh, if y'all like, y'all can say your own prayer or join me. But at this time, I'd like come to the altar of God and pray that you protect us, Father. Myself, those in chat, and those that see this video in the future. I pray that the only the good and the light, if anything is here, that it is only of good and light in Jesus' name. That this is a safe adventure and a safe journey for me and my family and friends on YouTube. And I just pray that you be with us and, and Michael the Archangel to give us the strength and be there to fight our battles if need to be here in this property, Father Lord. You know the whole history of the Native Americans and, and, of, and of the Black African American people. And Father, I just pray that you protect us and surround us with the good and light of your spirits. Keep us the comfort that we need and protection that we need. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right. Here we go. This mansion is told to be haunted. Me and Papa came up out here and we cleaned up this property at one time. I had one of them old nickel uh, soda pop machines up on here, in here and stuff. Uh -huh. and this is some yard job stuff that I do. Some of the places we go to and such. But... Uh, 
there's quite the weeds up in here, as y'all see, and I'm fixing to have to create my own trail. I'll be having to take a rubbing alcohol bath because mosquitoes love me. They woke me up like I'm allergic to them. No matter how much I move, they'll still be on me. But I we'll have stick tights all over my sweats. Yeah. Yeah. You see that? Yep, I see it. Papa says that this used to be the old uh, unwed Indian's home and stuff. But being this time of year, I kind of <laughs> got to watch out where I step. Looks like an old pipe there of some sort. So it's, oh, I'll probably have to make me a path through here. But yes. This is very historical land as well that I'm on. And as you see, it's just ow, going to waste. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, wait till you get inside and we look at the old artifact and stuff that's up in here. History all over this building. Look at these steps. <laughs> I told you. Psycho, I got some hot spots. I do, I do, I do. Look at this. Well, thank you, Scott. If you can, please share this out, please. Share this out, everyone. Tears are on the board. See? Ooh, um, ooh. I don't. I try not to come in here that often because you know I, I I do have brain problem, and as you see, there's a lot of asbestos and mold, and if these windows were in here. I probably wouldn't even be in here at all. Hey, question for you, Biddy. How come you don't got a mask on? Oh, because the only kind I do have is them paper masks. They ain't going to protect you from nothing. Well, they'll protect you from invading that, that mold. No, it won't. Because I have long hair. I'm stepping on glass. And my hair keeps it. I still smell stuff through it. No, is that a bedroom or a living room? This looks like it could be a bedroom. I've uh -huh. not even went upstairs with you yet. Kind of. Got to build me up some cojones to go upstairs. Because that's where I had my experience. Oh, wow, that's, that's... Look uh... at this kitchen. Wow. That's crazy. Look at this. That's what I say, man. There's a lot of building here that's got a lot of history and, and and such in this area that's just abandoned, basically going to waste. You know, I mean getting tore up. I am not going down there. Sorry for yeah. No, I wouldn't I wouldn't go down there, no. But see, I ran around as you see this particular it's just right across the street from Papa's. 
<sighs> See the uh, work on them. Yeah, but what is that? What's that in the hallway? Is that like a is that a, like a dresser or something? Standing right there. Where? Right there in front, in of, front of you. Of me? Yeah. Like a closet or something? It's another closet. Oh, okay, See? okay. All right. No, I just I was just look, it just looked I never seen one like that. That's cool. That's that's a lot of work. A lot of good a lot of different uh artifacts of work. About that fourth or fifth step there. Yeah. One day Papa and me was up in here, first time I'd ever been here. And I'd got to that fourth or fifth step coming down. And yeah. it kind of felt like something pulled my hair and pulled me back. That's why I'm wanting to do this before it gets much darker or later. Well, you should tell them, you got to make sure you tell the spirits that you're just there to, to see the beautiful. They stuff. already know. They're already, that's what I say. They already know. These yeah. spirits are already used to me. They already know that I come in peace. And I'm just yeah. showing the history. <clears throat> see? Right there. Yeah. See that old well down there? Uh huh. I'm going to go down there and I'm going to give you a closer look. Right there's the stairs. Plus me being a female, that helps. Look here. Can anybody what tell is, me what that is? What is that? What is it? Anybody know? Is it a hot tub? No. Here. No, okay. Maybe okay. Arcade system. How's that for blast? Oh, shit. I ain't going to step there. That looks... No. Wow, there's an arcade system up there. Wow. That's weird. Yeah. But, uh... <laughs> yeah. Another little closet, like bookshelf closet. In the bigger bathroom. This is like a shower room type place. I'm sure. Yeah. That's, that's old. That's old, like I said. That's old school. The way they did, the way they have right. it, they have the the animals to it. You know the way they built it. Right. This is Lord in one of the earlier homes. Mm hmm. But yeah. <sighs> okay, Frank. I think I'm gonna head back downstairs. Uh yeah, go ahead and head back down. You feel, as long as you feel uncomfortable. My, 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 oh, snap. My voice and my breathing, it's, yeah. it's done. Yeah. Go back done. Down. Be careful. All right, ladies. Y'all be nice. Y'all see, I did not disturb nothing up here. Be nice to me. I'm being nice and respectful with y'all. Telling your story and... Showing the beautiful home. Okay. We will head out now. We appreciate the hospitality of allowing us here. I'll go back here and show you that part. Uh, my daughter. No, what I'm doing. Hang on. I'm anyway, guys. Yeah. Um. That that is weird, isn't it? Isn't that weird? How um the structure of the house is set up. 
the way they built the doorways and I mean the uh, the framework on it. It's just it is weird. Like I said, that's a Native American house, guys. Um, back in the days. Can um, y'all still hear me? Yeah, uh, I was just All trying right. to. Uh, I mean, that's back there is another of, building. Tell the Native Americans and you know and the Hispanics and all that. That's how they build their homes. Uh, back in the days, they were have you know they didn't have square doors. Everything was like a roundabout. You know, special, you know, stairways, beautiful stairways like that. And the arches, I, I, I'm not sure, don't quote me, but the arches with natives are, are a symbol of, of peace, uh, the tranquility to keep spirits down. Whew. All right. Uh, boy, I about fell backwards that time. Oh, my lambs. Out, limbs are attacking. I'm working at it here, folks. There's that basement I showed you from up there. Oh no! Please get away from me. I just got the chills when you did that. Yeah, something's definitely uh, playing out here. Look at this. Just a minute. No, no. I just always had. I always had. Uh, the chills when I ever seen the basement that went down from the outside of the house. I always had it for some reason. I always got chills about it. I don't know you why. You know, I've been all over this mansion. That is one place. I don't know. Some reason I'm not able to. You see, what you've seen me do is the closest I've been able to get. No doubt. So, like I said, that's just you know you are just doing it. I respect you're not you're not trying to harm anything. You're not trying to. No, bringing harm to the house or any, you know, any spirits or anything. You just want to show the. To me, off. this all is part of history, and you see, Mother Nature is reclaiming it. And, you know, this is a part of history in my hometown. Look here, you know what that is? It's a water well, isn't it? Yes, sir. Check out. Does it still have water in it? See? Do they throw water in it? Beauty? Huh? Does it still have like water? Does it still have water in the well? Yes, sir. Wow. Don't you see how wet it is? Yeah. Wow. See? Wow. It's just old. It's hard to turn. Yeah. Oh. Okay, folks. That was that adventure up here. Now this fall, I do want to try and come down here after this has all died out and get another life about it, you know? I've been in that garage before it. The roof fell in. So Some places in that mansion ain't far from it, as y'all see. And that's a two-story garage? Yes, sir. Wow. Like a garage apartment. Wow. Me and Papa kind of worked at doing that big-ass tree. Wow. Ooh. Okay. You don't make no promises. I'm going to try and go into another zone. Now, back here. All right, I got to jump off and then I'll jump back in. Give me a second. Back here is where all the dirty deeds are done in the day. Uh, right through that wood line there. And then there's another building off over there. But yeah.
Okay, go ahead and put yourself back in the solo. Did y'all share it out? They've done missed the better part of it. Yeah, that 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 is that is a trip. That house is. Just you need to let catch up. I can't hear what you're saying, Frank. I said that 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 house has beautiful structure to it. Oh yes, and my uh, psycho Sasquatch says it can still be refurbished. It can still be redone. Yeah, but the thing is, is do you really want to do it on knowing that it was on native land? Natives really don't, spirits don't like people, to, you know, trying to take back their land. And this was a hard shit. Ooh, snap. Look There's a eyes. lot of hardship and darkness done on this property. Like that's what I'm saying. Do you really would you really want to buy a property that, that's been a Native American property, that, you know? They need to more concentrate on Maria Marjorie and the tall chief theater. Yeah. My personal that's opinion. That's what I'm saying. It's like, you know, it's beautiful to restore. I would love to yep. restore it like that, but if you think about it in the long run, that's a you know that's actually you know bound to the Native American. You know, if you're not Indian or any have any you know, history with that, I wouldn't want to mess with it. You know. Well, I got that it. crap all over me. Look like okay. I walked through a porcupine. You got a lot of dark demons, Jen. Huh? <laughs> you got a lot of dark demons. You ain't nothing like that. I wouldn't be out here. Don't oh, even go no. talking that or calling that. No, no, no. I'm just saying because, you know, it being an Indian, you know, Indian Native American property, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying they're, all, they're bad. I'm just saying. You That's just it. I know the old boy personally that owns this land. I've asked him if I could come out here and do what I'm doing, and I told him that I'm a YouTuber and I do this kind of stuff, and I'm showing the history and such that's here in town. So is the person that you know the You've person. been to the stores with me, Frank. You know how I talk to folks. Yeah, and you know the person that owns the property, you do. Huh. Hang tight on panel. Chatter, hang tight. I'll be right back. I got to okay. get some sound to this. But yeah, guys, you know. I, I'm not saying anything bad about the property. I'm just saying I, I am Native American myself, and I would I'd still be cautious about and some property like that, just because it is history. It is you know, you know I would be I would be careful myself. You know, I'm not saying anything bad. You know, I'm just saying even oh, I. Oh, I'm be, all everywhere you go in this town, you got to be cautious and careful and aware because. We entertain thousands unawarely every day. See, see, if you guys didn't know, my my grandma's Yaqui Indian. Yeah. For, and and the Yaquis were were they, they were big time uh, with the Cherokees and all them, all the big times, and they worked with them and did things for them, you know, and worked with the tribals, you know, and did all kind of stuff, trades and all kind of stuff. So. Okay. So the Native Americans are, the, are, are so we our, our tribal would know the Native Americans. We know. Oh, you know, he's too busy running his yap. Yep. I almost yep. fell flat on my face just then, dude. Well, 
almost went forward. It's time to get out of this shit. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I think Psycho Squatch, see, this is the thing. If I buy a property like that, I would restore it and make it a, like a museum. And make exactly. everything... I would never live in it. I would just make it like a museum where somebody could pay two, three dollars, walk in there, look at the property, you know, look at some, some uh, papers, you know, and, and history of it, you know, and different things, you know, of the history of, the, you know, that tribal or whatever. That's what I would do. I would not have anybody live in it, you know. You may have pictures of the owner back in the day, you know, when it was first built or whatever, you know, what it looked like, you know, when it was fully first built, something like that. I would do something like that, you know, and make it like a, like a museum where you walk in, you know, you, and you Got look it. at like articles and Hang stuff like on. that. Go ahead. Uh, but that's what I would do. Uh, that's how I, way I would handle it. I would never live in it. I would just make it to where, you know, it'd be where people could go and read history on it, uh, see artifacts, things that they might have back in those days, what the Indians used, what kind of tools they used, you know, stuff like that. Uh, I've done that, child. You know. First of all, I would never live in it. I would store it to, you know, like I said, to the natural natural foundation. And then I would I'd definitely make it to where, you know, the people would come and visit and look at it. You know, and see, you know, my uh, artifacts, pictures of the Indians, you know, that actually owned the land at the time. So like that, you know, you could read like, you know, back in 1939, you know, they were fighting this tribe war, they were fighting against this or whatever, you know, whatever the history was, I'll find something like that, you know, and then make people pay a couple bucks, you know, just to come in and read it, you know, keep up. I would say the Indians were battling with the white man for their finances and territory. You need to tell her to stop calling or stop texting. She's making it. Oh, you know what's up? That time it was Papa calling, or her calling from his phone. Sorry, I am. I'll try to shut down as quick as I can. But yeah, but you know, that's what I, that's what I would do. I would I'd make it where it'd be a hist historical building, you know, with some you know, articles and. Everything like that, you know, that's the way I would do it. And then, you know, people that, that you know, and then people that want to come in and read the papers and read, you know, see what kind of different things, you know, the history of it. Then, you know, charge a few bucks, you know, just to keep the up. That was probably you know? went by. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. You, know, have, you know, just have, you know, a couple bucks, you know, maybe five bucks to enter, you know. And then that five bucks of people visiting, that would go back to, you know, paint, keeping the building painted, you know, keeping the floors clean, you know, things like that, you know. It would go back into the structure, not not to my pocket. It would go back to the structure. Keep uh, the upkeep, you know. Today with the dog's name, hello. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for coming. Uh, Beat of Nature is on. Uh, be right back. Uh, just let you know. She'll be right back. But yeah, we were looking at a uh, historical building of a Native American family. Um, it, it was actually pretty nice, actually. Kind of got creepy a little bit. I, you know, I don't like going into buildings like that. But. It's good Look to see. Up. I've been telling them all day that I was gonna come over here and do this. No, so, I think I think I'd be more. I think I'd be more like I guess you'd say more excited if it was just if I was there with her, 
and actually witnessing it, you know, like actually standing in the building. Oh, yeah, feeling the 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 heaviness, the sorrow. It's Hello. Uh, but yeah, that's what that's what I would say. When have um, you known me to to breathe like this, Frank? Yeah, never. So as I say, you need to stop, take a breath, relax for a minute, catch your breath back. Where you? I'm back at Papa's now. Hell, he's like still out hunting me. Shows how much they listen to me, huh? Yeah. But thank you for thank you for sharing that. That was excellent. I'll be right back. Um, yeah, she hey, Roman. Back. I'll be right back. All right. But yeah, guys, you know something like that. You know it. Uh, it is. It is. It is history. Uh, she took us on the bridge, the the first bridge that goes into her town. And that bridge is tore up. But it's something you would see in the movie theaters. Like you would see in the movie, you know, an old wooden bridge, you know, going from one town to another town. It was kind of cool. And then a little river running underneath it. But like I said, that's all history, you guys. Uh, she does, She loves showing you guys the history of the, her of her you know, area. I hope you guys enjoyed it, Roman. If if you if you missed it, uh, when you, this streams end, go back to the beginning. You will see it. Uh, it's a great little thing to see. Uh, she was actually in a Native American's home uh, back in the day. It's kind of beat down. Um, when she did first walk into it, I'm not going to lie. It it reminded me of The Last of Us, part two. I had that eerie feeling. Do you have a camera? Yeah, she likes to show us history like that. Uh, yeah, take a take a minute, rest there, beauty. Say another prayer to yourself, you know, make sure that you know you didn't have any ending fall on you. That was a hike and a half, I think. Yeah. It was fun. Yeah. And like I said, we seen uh, me and her been on uh, just a drive using this thing, and, and she showed me some other buildings where, you know, where some people, a person hung herself or something. And, I mean, there's some really history places out there. You know? She even told me the history of, of a person that I uh, guess killed herself and didn't and didn't see somebody didn't find it for like two weeks or something like that. Yeah, it was weird. Uh, you're talking about the uh, tall chief mansion. He didn't hang himself. He was murdered there. Oh yeah, no, but remember he showed me another house that had the tree, in, big old tree in the front. You said that they, they, they hung themselves or something. Someone hung herself? No, they've seen an image of spirit. We were seeing a spirit oh. in the tree. Even oh. the prince seen that. Or, excuse me, even Paul seen that. Yeah. So you guys think about it. There's some history there. Like I said, she likes to share this stuff with you guys. Sorry, I don't have my camera on because my camera, every time I turn it on, it, it, it starts to buff for her, for her, so I don't have my camera on right now. I don't want it to buff for her. And then she can't hear me for some reason. I can so. hear you now. I had to go out and come back in. 
happens when I get called. Yeah. Yeah. Other than that, we can hear you now. But yeah, I mean, she goes in the stores, guys, and she does. Everyone talks to her. Everyone knows everyone by their name, first name, last name. You know, uh, it's it's just weird because you, hey, Natalie, you know, <laughs> a cashier or whatever, you know, or Jose or whatever it is, you know. And it's like, wow, like you know, my first and last name, huh? Did he? Did I get? We all know each other. So I can imagine if I walked in there, they'd be like, who the heck is this guy? I've never seen him before. All right. Yeah, Mexican, Mexican showing up. Who the heck is he think he's come from? <laughs> like, I'm not, I'm Mexican, but I'm Indian. Don't give me that. Yeah. I swear, I look like a porcupine shot me. That and stick tights everywhere. Yeah. Well, it looks like you guys need to you guys need to go out there and cut some of those weeds down. Shoot. He's the owner of that property got brush hog. Why don't he do it? Or pay somebody to do it. One of the two. Right. I mean, all you have to really do is go out there with the weed whacker around the edges and then run the lawnmower over everything else. You know? He's got a brush hog. Freaking damn thing walks itself. All he does is hold on to it and guides it. It does the rest. He don't got push or nothing. Who are you laughing at, Skaga Squash? You know, because I said Mexican. <laughs> I just, I just I said I'm Mexican because I said I'm Mexican Indian. Not to mess with me, he's so laughing. Oh, it's true. Like I said, I don't mess with the spirits. It's uh, six o'clock, Larry, and everybody be able to catch it. Oh, they will. He, he, he shared it out. Hopefully, they'll, they'll, they'll catch the. If they didn't catch the live, they'll catch it on the replay. Oh, yeah, I'm sure of that. Yeah, I'm still picking porcupine splinters off. Well, it's true. I mean, you, you got to remember, in her little town, everyone knows everyone. So if somebody else new came in, they'd be like, who the heck is this guy? Yeah. One thing about it, I'm a new YouTuber, so everybody's wondering who the hell I am or what I'm about. But it's all good. I try to stay positive. You did. You ate a Mexican pizza. How dare you, Roman? Oh, yeah, that's what I was waiting on, that air to get over here. There it is. How dare you, Roman? Eat a Mexican pizza. And not not bring me one, Roman. Don't you slam that cat on my back like that ever again, Misty. And I mean that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't get hostile. Dude, don't get hostile. I'm down. Sorry about that. Yeah, don't get your channel. Don't get your channel struck. We're staying back in live streaming. You get your channel struck, going crazy. Don't do that. Yeah, about became stormy, didn't I? Yeah. That was good. How come you didn't share with us? Roman. Ah, good and refreshing. How dare you, Roman? Mm. 
But yeah, guys. Okay. That's cool. Thank you for uh Beauty for doing that. That's cool. But like I said, uh I think Psycho Squats knows uh if he I think he's seen the previous uh and I think uh Roman might have seen the previous. But that house remind me when I when she first walked up to it, it reminded me of The Last of Us Part Two. There's a part there's a house looks just like that in the video game. Windows broken. It did. It had that eerie look. I was just waiting for like a screech or something. Oh, like by this time of evening, you know how they get when you, yeah. Or a zombie to pop out of the, out of the, out of the hallway. I knew I'd be out at about seven. About seven thirty, eight o'clock. It starts getting dark, but they're starting to play over there right now. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't go in that place if it, at night. Definitely, I would not go in there at night. Now, if I, if I had a, a experienced people, you know, with with the EVP detectors and all the meters and temperature gate, you know. Yeah, uh, yeah, that would be different. But no, I am no. As you've seen, I'm out of there before that sunset. Me and Papa both had experiences. That back part that I told y'all that all the dirty deeds was done in the back part behind them woods. That's where Papa had his experience. And mine was like I say about that third, fourth step going up, coming down the stairs. But yeah, I'd be back, be back in y'all's view in a moment, but I'm still here. <laughs> I didn't see the one down in the in the basement. No way, me and Papa, neither one will go down in that basement. No, yeah, up here, across the street. No, see, no, no. I look like porcupines got me. <laughs> Did you hear Papa? What do you say, Papa? Frank said, "What you said, Papa?" I said, "Too many dead people up there. That fight that." Go, go, go. Go, go. go, thank you. No, thank you. I'm praying before I go any farther. I'm praying. Y'all pray with me or in agreement. Uh uh. No wall play in that property. Even with the owner's permission. Actually, I was rather shocked when OT told me to go ahead. I really, well, I asked him personally at the store, and he said, "Yeah, sure, go ahead." When I went into all them haunted things, I've been the tour guide would knock on the door and ask for permission to come on to the property. Yeah. So I got a question. Um, I know you did it. You're down there anyway. Too late right now. Oh, that's where I was when y'all were calling me. I was on my way back. I got a question for Papa or 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 uh, or grand, uh, Grandma. I know the spirits. Yes, I do. They've already gave me. I've been there cleaning up and stuff. So yeah, they know I'm doing good. They know, they know I'm good. That's what I told my people here, my viewers and Frank. They know I'm never, I've never been on his property a hundred times, and I've never left with anything that I was not granted permission. That we was cleaning it up when we did, and that was that old fi uh, nickel, uh, old school nickel soda pop machine. But, uh, but, uh, Atari, no, the. I went blank. That Atari game thing is still up there, the big one. The, yeah, the big one. It's still upstairs. The garage port or the garage roof finally fell through. There ain't no roof on that old back garage, too. 
Let me ask. Let me ask Baba something. He might be asking. Baba, give me some. Give me some back backlog on that house. I know you know a lot about it. Some history about that house. There was motors in the of that house. Did you hear me? What? I didn't hear you. That's right. There was motors in the bar in the basement that she just come out of. Uh huh. In that house. Wow. Was... Oh, yeah, hello. Yeah, that's that's crazy, Papa. That's crazy that they, they got murdered in the in the basement, huh? Oh yeah. They, they oh. sometimes they, they they find parts of bodies down there. Oh. Yeah, I wouldn't. Miss, I wouldn't miss. I wouldn't mess with that place. Uh uh-uh, uh, not the basement. Uh uh-uh. uh. Let the spirits rest, man. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, she's but, telling straight up truth. But Bubba, why would why would there be an arcade system up up upstairs if if nobody lived in that place? Wasn't that ba- place abandoned a long time ago? Well, yeah, they went. They, they probably uh. Smoked it a few times, but the spirits are probably so strong that they didn't do enough of it, I guess. Yeah, because that, you know that, yeah, that's weird. Cause that, when she showed me the arcades, the arcade game up there, I was yeah. like, wow, I'm like, i never seen anything like that before. Not upstairs, anyway. You would think it would be on the bottom, you know, with heavy, heavy machinery like that. You know, that somebody must have carried it up there or something. Well, no, she, I'll tell you what, if she shows you something, you better know it's true, because... Yeah, yeah. No, I just I just had an eerie feeling. When she walked in that place, I was like, you know, it's beautiful inside, you know. It's, it's a beautiful, you know, how it's designed. But, yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't mess with anything in there. No, I, I you know, I, it's beautiful. I mean, it's a beautiful structure. I'm glad you guys, you know, can enjoy it. I can tell my daughter. I'm not nutty. She's kind of nutty, but she she don't mind going places. I'm cray cray. Well, yeah. I mean, you got to be a little bit cray cray to go in that kind of place, Papa. It's all for them. Deer coaches went taking knee deep in them thick tights. Dude. That thing's over my head. That's Frank. (laughs) Yeah, she got to be a little bit cray cray to go in the places like that, Papa. I know she's got you. <laughs> but you know, I I, I love the history of, of of the Native Americans. So when she showed me that house, I I was like I was like, ooh, wow, look at that! You know how they you know how they built the doors, how they had the door structure. So that, that's different from nowadays. You know, everything's square, but not there. You know, everything's like in yeah. uh, you know has that oval looking top. You know, and you know different kind of doors. You know, and that's beautiful. I mean, that's. Like I said, that's Native American style, you know? How they brought their back in the day, you know? I'm trying to get... We're trying to get over there to the... Parhuska? To the Swinging Bridge? Yeah. You can talk to them like that. Oh. Oh. Are you hear me? I can hear you. I can hear you. Okay, well, I'm, I'm taking you that... We're gonna go to that swinging bridge, so you so she can show you that one. And I bet you, if it was known, it's gonna be haunted too. It's swinging well, bridge, huh? First entrance and exit up to Huska when they first founded it. By the by, by the by the key shot, that was Joe. Uh, by Finley Old Church in right. Curlertown. So now when I we we get going, I got to go over another. Dang, the swinging bridge, huh, Papa? That, that, that sounds like it's haunted, the haunted place, Papa. That's just, that just sounds haunted when you say swinging bridge. That sounds haunted already. Hey, let's play a Like I told, uh, like I told Beauty, you know, uh, you know, I am, I am Native American, you know, and I have Native American blood in me a little bit. You know, I am Hispanic, uh, uh, Indian, and uh, and uh, Italian, and you know, I have a lot of respect for the you know Indian lands and stuff like that. Yeah, but those that, that house is beautiful. I mean, I wish somebody. Would, my idea of that kind of place is buying it, restoring it, and making it and making it like a museum. You know, 
for people to go and check out the pop, you know, check out you know different designs of it. That, that's what I would like to see something happen. Anyway, yes, we we go, Tony. At the same go, time, go. history. You can go, go, Tony, all you want, sweetheart. So I, I, I'll stay right here at my lovely town. I got enough ghosts around me. I don't need no more ghosts. Because I live in a ghost town, yeah? I mean, it, it's dead. The town's dead, and there's a lot of, of um, unsolved, I guess you could say, unsolved mystery, de mysterious death. Uh, there's a lot of unknown, a lot of dirt here that not many talk about. Well, you can't see my uncle behind me because I have my thing off, but my uncle uh, and I was watching this program. There's a place down, uh, it's called Old Town. Oh, yeah, a lot of history, dirt history. Right. You would even say. I mean, you would be like, what? Uh, I'll, uh, I'll uh, yeah, so there's waste down, uh, beauty down, uh, probably about, it's like, it's like 30, it's about 20 minutes away. It's called Old Town. It's called Old Town, and they have an old mess. It's like all shops and stuff, right? On the property, you know, Mexican restaurants and everything. Uh -huh. but, uh, but there's a hotel, old hotel that's been there since way back when. It used to be a mercenary, and they turned into a hotel. And uh, and everything around that, it used to be a it used to be a burial a burial so like a cemetery. And they built all this, this, this old town on top of it. And, and at night, people say they hear the the buildings like, like you know the stores, the logs going off and stuff like that. And there's nobody, nobody around. And what it is, it's the ghost. What was that? The ghost. Shouldn't this cat be in a butthead? The the ghost go. I guess they come out at night and they roam the the town, you know. And they sit up in the arms. They and the people live in the the hotel you can see in is haunted. And there's like history of people writing their what happened, their experiences in a book. Like people walking across the windows, doors opening, showers going on, footsteps in the in, in the bathroom. It's weird because, like I said, people be actually cool. stay, in, stay in this hotel and it's haunted. Like I said, it's built on a cemetery, an old cemetery back, back, way back. Well, I'm talking about probably 1800s or something like that. Yeah. And it's a burial ground that used to be a cemetery and they built a, a, a thing called an old town. And, it, and and if you go, if you go, if you look at the street, on the street, there's little coins. It's a little coin about this big. About this no, big. About, no, about, no about this freaking hay bar. It's bigger than the bottle cap. How about this big? A little bit bigger. About a bottle cap. In the middle of the street. He's in here. He's live. In the middle of the streets, they have people's no, name on it. My phone's being in heads up. But in the middle of it, there's uh, these, uh, like, like stones or little coins or whatever. There's people's name on it where there was a somebody buried there on, on the, and it's all up and down the street. It's weird. It's weird. And I never knew anything to it until I read. Uh, my buddy told me about it, and my, I think me and my uncle watched the thing on TV, the history of Old Town, and uh, it's haunted. I mean, it is haunted. It is haunted big time. Some people say they see like shadows and stuff when they when they're walking down the streets and stuff. People say they see shadows and stuff. I mean, it is weird. I don't go down there anymore. Trust me, I don't go down that way. Not during the day, not during the night. I'll go down there during the day, but I will not go down there during the night. Well, that's how I am with a lot of places around here. I and will it, go during that, especially Tall Chief Mansion and that one I just did. Them two places at, at Grey Horse Cemetery. Them three I'll do during the day by myself. 
But at night, oh, hell no, 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 no. Because with Grey Horse Cemetery, spirits have been known to follow people home from that. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I never. I I never. I I I was young, so I know. I don't remember if I ever went down there and came back home and had. I know one time I had a I had a dream about like a ghost of me or something, and I don't remember if it, it was after I went down to Old Town or whatever. But I I don't go down there during the night. I used to go down there during the night. Shops are cold, you know. They got that Mexican theme, you know, the Indian Mexican yeah. theme, you know, going on. Uh, but you know, I don't go down there at night. Look I, here. I Watch this. I walk out my papa's door and look at what's in front of us. Oh, I'm getting a glare. What is it? Uh, you can Google this building and get the, the original look of it. It's the old school, the colored school here in town from back when the KKK and everybody was here. What? At this time of night, yes. Starting to get that time of day where the blacks had to be on this side of the tracks. Oh. And all whites had to stay on that side. See it? Okay. Yeah, I see, the, see, the, I see a white building, yeah. But this is one of them places that I'm going to have to wait until the fall when all these weeds are down. Hang on. I'm in flip-flops and shorts. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at that. You what are you, what, are you doing? what are you doing in flip-flops? You're going to do something. You're going to do flip-flops. Oh, I, I see it. I see, I see the building, yeah. See, that's the entrance right there. And if you look on Google, Old Black School in Fairfax, Oklahoma, you'll be able to see it when it was up and looking good before they shut it down and, and in nature again. Oh, oh they, got, they, they got it bounded off, huh? They got some wire across it so you don't cross that wire. That's the fenced-in yard, yeah. I could get you in know, there if I really wanted to, man, but, no, but I really don't want to. to. Yeah, but you're not supposed you know? to. That, they're supposed to keep people out of that area. No, no. It was to keep their horses in. <sighs> See right here? Yeah. They tie off horses, and the horses no. eat all that. <laughs> Yeah, she did in Oklahoma, uh, Fairmont. What do you say, Fairmont County? Osage County. Osage County. Home Back of the famous the... ballerina Marjorie and Maria Tallchief. Yeah. See right uh, there, the driveway to where we just came out of. Yeah, and, uh, we were, a lot of the Native Americans had homes there, and and yeah, uh, and uh, and she lives in a small town where. Uh, we just got out. She just did a tour of a uh, uh, building. It was one of the that gorgeous sunset. And it was it was it was eerie when you because you know it was you know a building that's kind of run down you know. But right down that road, right there in front of you. And it, but it was beautiful to see the how they build like the doorways. They're totally different from our doors. Yeah. Yeah, they had, you know, and, their, and the way they built the stairway is... Frank, like, why? hold up. Shh. Do you have a radio or something on? No. I think something just came through my phone, and I don't got no voice detector or EVP that just told me you better stay out of there. <laughs> and look, you see, look, look at where I am. Right there's the driveway. Uh, I was trying... To to the school? I'm not going back in there. To the school? Yeah, this is where we went down the road to that mansion. This wow. is the entrance. Wow. And you've seen, I was in the middle of this road. And it wasn't all your voice echoing, dude. I know your voice. I've done enough of these with you. And in the middle of that road, before I got this close. Oh, oh, oh. 
It said, you better get out of there. Through my damn phone. I'm out of there. Hold on. Hold on. You quiet for a minute. I hear, I hear aesthetic. Hold on. Something going through your screen. I hear, I hear. I just see even my screen's flickered and flashing. All right, I think you need to end the stream because uh, I think we're catching something that we don't need to have. Yeah, I was. It's haunting or going. I was just showing you. I'm going back in my papa. Ooh. Don't say that, Uncle. Marco said that. Marco said they're gonna fuck you. In Jesus' name, you were to stay out here. If you've attached, get away. In the name of Jesus, you go back over there across the street in that building where you belong. In Jesus' mighty name, in Jesus' name, stay out. I don't hear in Frank. I'm here. I'm here. Stat I'm here. Static. I hear static, and 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 right now I hear static. When you don't talk and I don't talk, I hear like growling. No, it's like a static. It gets loud sometimes, and then it gets real quiet. They're probably. Stop it, Uncle. You're, getting, you're gonna give me nightmares tonight. <laughs> like, they're, he's like, you know, they're, they're following her home and, they, and they're going through your phone. And well, no, they ain't following me nowhere. They they back across the street where they belong. Uh uh, they gotta flee from the name of Jesus and God. Nuh uh. They got to leave. And he said that, and he said that their GPS, GP, GP, GPS, my home right now to find me. Yeah, they got a long way to go. <laughs> I bet you never seen me move so fast, huh, Frank? No, I never. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, they already got you, Uncle. They got you recorded. No, I, I know your uncle and your aunt's voice and the boys' voice. That wasn't none of it was like, yeah, yeah. That type of shit. No kidding, dude. <sighs> Man. Uh, you you got to say another prayer. Cause they, that, that, you don't that, think that, I ain't been? <laughs> that, that is scary. I think I was moving along. Well, no, she's in front of her her dad's house right now, and, and but she was in, in the middle of the street, and that's where the entrance to that mansion is, is right across the street, and and and, and she got right about right in the middle of it, uncle. I was telling my uncle, right in the middle of it, and she heard a voice say, "Don't go in there," like. Get away from there. Or get away from there or something like that. And that's what she said. It growled. Uh, it, it growled at me. No. Uh, I'm good. I, I'm staying right here where I'm at. <laughs> you, you can stay over in Oklahoma. Thank you. Amen. You can stay over there. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear what he said? He said, he said, go ahead, next time they, they yell you like this, said, go ahead, make me, bitch. <laughs> now, call them. I'm still out here with them. I'm still outside. This is a colored side of town. I mean, this is, I mean. He said, he's over here laughing. At it. He's like, oh, shit. He's like, yeah, you should tell her. Oh, hell no. Hell no. 
<laughs> Uncle get kicked out of it, is he? Yeah, he get kicked out. He's like, yeah, you should yard him. I'm like, yeah, what good does that do? <laughs> They're gross. They're gonna. This is gonna grab you by your toes that night. I mean, what you gonna do? You're gonna be like, oh. Well, I'll tell you what. Hey, I wasn't playing no game. It had me skitting and getting for sure. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm good. I'm not going to have anything. And name Jesus. You can stay in Oklahoma. Amen. Come on, Frank. You know you want to go on ghost hunting with me, bro. No, that, 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 that was, that was some scary stuff when you hear a voice like that. Uh, 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 uh no. Well, it wouldn't do for you to uh, uh, go on, on uh, ghost adventures or, or dead falls or nothing like that with them. Well, you'd be the first one, man. Your little, your little dead ass would go pale white and be the first one out that door. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I, 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 I'd be like speeding with Joyce. I'd be like, I need help. You'd give a whole new meaning to a pale skin, huh, Frank? Yep, I'd be like, like I said, I'd be like speeding with Zoris. I'd be like, Aliwa, Aliwa, Aliwa! Take off. How do you see yeah, the white you smoke or behind you? Those kind of or, or, or dead files and have you do a lockdown with them, huh? <laughs> no, no lockdowns with me. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah. Nuh-uh. You would see me come out whiter <laughs> than white. Kevin said I would run like fire hitting my horse. <laughs> yeah. Exactly, exactly. I'd be, I'd be like, I'd be like Steven Gonzalez. I always see the white smoke come out from my feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. He's like, hey, Frank, where the hell did you go? Oh, look, there he is. I see white smoke. Uh, uh, a uh, black street going across the, all the way down the, like a fire. Oh, shit. Larry's live, and I don't know how long, but I'm going to try to see the street yard like that we're out. <sighs> yeah, he's also live, so I don't know. No, no also, I do not want no pictures of no, no mansion. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> I, I, I'll pass. I did. Dude, that one there is nothing at all. I, I should you know nothing at all. Well, I heard you probably want to take me over to swinging, swinging Bridge. Uh, I don't know if I want to see that one. Oh, you can Google that and, and get the uh get get good good pictures of what it was compared. I mean, I don't even know what condition it's gonna be in after that flood. I don't know. If I'm going to be able to do a live stream with it, or if I need to do still shots and put it into a slideshow to upload, I, I'm not even sure. So if I'm going to it. Okay, so now, you, now you're saying it. What, what is the history on that swimming bridge? Well, it was the original route in and out of town mm -hmm. in uh, Oklahoma when that town was first founded. So, are there any murders or anything or people getting hung oh, by it? There's some dark history to the Swinging Bridge, but none that they announced or anything like that. I mean, you would just have to see it and 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 really to understand the Swinging Bridge. It's one of them that you have to experience. You'd have to experience it in person. Oh, uh, is it like the one where Uncle said, like there was on Beetlejuice? Huh? My uncle said, is it like the swinging bridge on Beetlejuice? The movie yeah, Beetlejuice? I know. Uh, and oh. what's that? Yeah, it's kind of. Yeah. Good. Hang on, man. I'm going to try something if I can't. Uh, I was just reading on it earlier today with Papa Sam trying to talk him into taking us out there. 
He's trying to do his comment. I know. Hey Roman, you wanna go you wanna go jump off the swinging bridge? But um Oh that I rope to your foot. Like bungee go bungee jumping. Hang on, let me I think I'm doing it right, I'm not sure. You know, I'm still learning all this guys. Bear with me. Well snap. I'm not sure. I think I just put that um uh, Hey, I should have followed him. Anyway. Well, I don't know. It's who the heck no? <laughs> Come on, Roman. We we need somebody to to take the ball for us. Uh, hold on, folks. I'm having a major blonde moment. I'm back. Just a minute. I forgot who I was looking for, Frank. Damn, you talk about short term memory. Hey, I might have had this tweet 24 hours because of you, Larry, in the group. Y'all saw, y'all did it. I've still been learning it. Uh oh. Uh, I am not saying one freaking word. I am so totally flipping lost. Yeah. No, really, I'm not finding our uh, my. Larry. Well, you know Larry's live, right? I think that's. Yeah, I told you that already, bud. And now I can't find the stream. I know y'all's loving that one. Y'all's laughing your asses off, ain't you? Yeah. Hey, hey. Just, just like you forgot to, to hit the go live button before you start talking. There was nobody in the chat room. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> like I say, I am new to all this. I, I am learning. still trying to learn. So, Roman, so I, I, told, I told, I told Beauty, I said, Beauty, look, I'm in the backstage. I'm waiting for you. So she comes in, she jumped on. Come on, we're talking. She starts walking up to this mansion, no, right? I'm lost. Right? Trying to find the panel. And right? and so I told her, I go, what is this? Okay, it still says schedule on, on on the top, right? I said, I said, Beauty, you didn't hit the go to live button yet. She said, yes, I did. I said, no, you, no, you didn't. She goes, oh, I didn't. It might, that might have helped. One moment. She told me forgot to go live button. Oh my god! Oh, one moment. Oh, one moment for. I can't mute her either. Sorry, I can't hey. mute her. There you guys go. She got kicked. Hopefully, oh, she'll be back now. But you guys, yes, that that was a, her toy blonde moment. Earlier, she forgot to hit the go live, and she kept on telling me, "Yes, I did." No, you didn't. It says, "I tell her it says schedule on her." 
And uh, she goes, oh, I did it. Oops. I'm back. Oh, God. Please, somebody help me. Help me. Let me out. Let me out. Man, I got totally lost. For really real. Yeah, that's a blind moment. It's called a blind moment, there. Well, I, I went to send you that link on the swinging bridge, and I could not find that stream. I had to shut all my pages down, except my sound booster, <laughs> just so I could get back to StreamYard to be able to get back on. Was that being totally lost or what? Yeah, you were lost a long time ago. You were lost in the beginning of, of this live stream. <laughs> you know what? It, it, it says it's being, but <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hey, you, you gotta love me. Uh, you know I had to call you out on that one. You know I had to call you that out on that one, sis. You would have so called me out on that one. If I would have done a blind moment like that, you would so be laughing right now. You would so have so many jokes on me. Yeah. You'd be like, I know you. So I had to get you first. So don't even, don't even say you wouldn't, you wouldn't, you would not be sitting there laughing at me. If I would not hit the go live button, you would have been so laughing at me. You would have so many cracking, so many jokes up on me. All right, now, Frank, don't be telling all my goofy blonde secrets. Why not? Yeah. Everyone told you my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> that's them. That's not me. Yeah. Tell everybody all my blonde secrets, and they're not gonna believe I've got ready to brown hair. We're gonna think I'm straight up blonde. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I'm laughing so hard. I never laughed so hard. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, crazy. That's why you keep me around. I give you good laugh, huh? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> you're my, you're my co-host. Yeah, I'm going to have somebody, have somebody keep me laughing. Oh, shit. Hey, ain't nobody brave enough to, 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 to put me on their panel, let alone have me on their, their co-host except you. <laughs> You and Eli. I don't hear that. I wouldn't hear that. Well, bang. <laughs> well, I, I, I would, I would love to have uh, on my panel one day if you can get to put it up. Uh, Roman? Roman is too scared, so is many. So, Roman, Roman's been up. He's been up on my head one time. Besides that, if I get Roman up here, that would have my mod up there, and it would make it very difficult for him to be able to do his job and keep trolls out. Like, I really have a lot of trolls. Well, he probably thinks being mod for my my screen probably the easiest mod job he's got. If I don't hook up to some electro, I am going to lose. Actually, if I don't hook up with some electro, y'all gonna lose y'all's host though. Are y'all getting dizzy yet? Let me keep spinning my phone a little more. What do you mean? I, I've been dizzy. 
That gum. Where's all of my viewers? My iron, 20 minutes. Yeah. Well, I gotta go and say hello to my other family. Larry. Yep. And I'll you. say what's this. Iron, 20 minutes, and we'll go. Hit them yeah. up. Yeah. So, right. yeah. Yeah. We'll, we'll stay a little longer, but I do need to stop in and say hello, you know. Well, then, you got any, any final words, co host? No, no, no. We're not there now. I'm just saying, whenever you're ready. No, because we you haven't been on your channel for a while, so let's stay on your channel and get you some. Where's all your viewers at, though? I don't know. It's just been me, you, and Roman, and a few popping in and out. Yeah, Roman's keeping all the ghosts out, he said. I think he's keeping my viewers out, too. Roman, don't keep the viewers out. Only the ghosts. Okay? Only the ghosts, Roman, not the not the viewers. Who are you going to call? Ghostbusters! Dun, dun, dun. That was pretty cool, though. It's until I went ahead and out, and, and I kind of got pushed forward a couple of times. That was, and, and you were running your mouth. You didn't even see it. Did you see it, Roman? Roman, he's calling Ghostbusters. That's what Roman told me. He said he's, he's calling Ghostbusters right now. Eli has got a stream where I went into the me, Latrinda, her little friend, and baby boy all went into the Fall Chief Mansion, and I believe it it, it is on Eli's stream. Well, you got, well, you got to do it again so we can see it. Well, her little well, I know her little friend came out of there with three scratches. So I, I really gotta. I don't even know if many me will do that one with me again. I know my boy. Well, he went running down there. He heard this. He heard something grab. <laughs> I look. <laughs> That big ass boy, six foot tall, four hundred and sixty nine pounds, was running down that driveway. Damn. His hands up in the air. He's running. I'm out of here. I'm out. Of here. <laughs> I'm out of here. I'm here. I can imagine him running. I can imagine him running too. He's like, I'm out of here. See you, Mom. Yeah, that uh, tall cheek mansion, that, that long, that's where the two famous ballerinas was raised, and there's been a couple, few murders up in there. One, my papa Sam and a husband was in the military with him. He's seen it. Roman's seen it. I went forward. Coming out of there, and I was not in the tall part of them weeds. It was low. And I was coming out of there, and freaking, I went like that twice. Twice. My whole top half went forward. Oh, I got I'm out of here, guys. <laughs> and just now, I went out a few minutes ago when I went out, and I was showing them the colored school, black school here across the street. And I, I, I did a little circle Ooh, shit. across here from your house over to there. 
showed them that, and then I went across the street there, showing them the view from from over here, and I got to the middle part of the road. And Papa, I kid you not, we heard a growl, and it was not Frank, but it came through my phone. We heard it. It said, "Get away." Uh. Just like that, if not deeper, and still, whoa! I was in the middle of the road, crossing from the corner over there, showing them the 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 entrance, brick entrance things, and it was a male growl, and it went that way, like that right there, exactly, was it not? What? <laughs> I'm straining to see it, Roman. Uh, <laughs> I need my viewers to go uh, find the witness that it uh, growled through my phone. If we did not have random or or EVP or, or ghost salmon or app or none of that, that grabbed through our fight. Yeah. See, Roman said, I'd be running too. When oh, I went to pick that face head down that damn Broadway, he said he would have been doing the same. Well, Roman was the first one to run. run. He talking hey, about. Hey, I get that cool spot. Remember, I said, oh, I feel something about that time. I said that. I'm like, oh, I'm out of here. Because you know, Sam, when they get fired up and get, I'm running out of my presence, you know, I start getting that chill and the hair on my neck start standing up. And the arm, and, and get them damn goosebumps. And I started doing that, and I looked at my screen, and I said, okay, they gave me the sign that I'm done. I said, I got to go. But I was in the back part by, by, by the garage showing them that wood line where they did all the dirt. And, and I got that coach, coach Hill listening to me. And I, whoa, I'm out. <clears throat> I think you should take us to the part where you went. You were sitting on that log in front of the house, and you said you felt you hit your baby's crying. Oh, that 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 there was that uh, Titty Hill, Booby Hill, as you call it, Nipple Hill, as you call it. Yeah, Nipple Hill. Crown Mount. Now that up there is no trespassing. Now, uh, Mr. Keeler owns it. And it is no trespassing. Uh, he last we tried, mom and I tried to go up that way with Stephen and them. They had a, a uh, like barbed wire type fence, kind of like what I ran into at the school there. The round mount, the old water well where they were throwing the baby, uh, unwed mother's baby. It's got his color green iron fence that he uses on his land. And it, it, it. Now that would be, I wouldn't even want to be up there on that night if, if, if a real paranormal group was to go up there. I would leave that part to them because I. I you did leave that part to them. <laughs> I'll leave that one to the professional because that's some real shit up there. Pardon the French, but that is the real shit right there, people. I mean, I'm straight up telling you it, it ain't no good spirit up in that place. I was like, like uh, 12 years old. I, I was like 12 years old and we was all up there. A few of us children with our adult and and I was sitting on the doorway of it. And if you go and you look on my channel, I've got a um, I think it's a slideshow where me and Latrina is out tootling and we was clicking pictures of it. But you look and you can see a door and it, it looked like a silhouette up in that door. I mean, I, if it, yeah. That if, if ever anything at all is haunted in this town, it is that hill. Oh, Nipple Hill? Nipple Hill? 
Yes, sir. Oh, I, have, come on. I have experienced it. I felt them. I've heard them. I. Not, not Nipple Hill, never. Oh, there's dark, 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 dark history of Nipple Hill out there. Sad, dark. And they don't share it. The living or the dead does not share that dark history. Oh, come on. We want, we want, we want to go up to Nipple Hill. We want well, to hear uh, Why don't you call uh, uh, Zach or, or, or uh, Air, uh, not Air, um, Dead Files or Ghost Adventures, the Ghost Hunters, or but just call the professionals for that one, please. Don't call Beauty of Nature. That's nature that I'm out. I'll show you the views of it. I'll video it when we go out that way tootling. I'll take pictures, but I know what we feel out there and, and how the whole family and everybody that I take out that way feel. Oh, okay. You can't be scared, scared of Nipple Hill, are you? Yes, is that scared of Nipple Hill? You've been out there tootling with us. Yeah, but it can't be that scary. It's Nipple Hill. <laughs> Just nipples. Yeah. Uh huh. But that nipple got a lot of dark, sad, heartbreaking, torturous history to it. Kind of like this one across the street here that used to be the unwed mother's home. The one we just left. And as you see, I'm still trying to, from that experience. So, yeah, that, that's a rush. For me, that is a rush. Everybody says, I'm like, sending your fun crazy out there, taunting them spirits and playing with them. Come on, listen up. You should go out there doing Indian dance. Oh, go right ahead. You go right ahead, Frank. Go out there. <laughs> Uh huh. You just know what's going Anytime you get crazy or brave enough, hop on that old plane and come on and, and just stay the night there. I, I bet I would not last all night. No, I said stay in the night there. I'm just saying we we'll have to do a rain dance or something. Nah. Nah. <laughs> we'll pass on that. Yeah, we definitely gonna have pass on that adventure. What, 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 what you doing? Your kung fu fighting? Oh, see, 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 see. Where is it? A kung fu fighting, Frank? See, see, see how you, see how you bring that in. See, see, I, I see how you. Look. I see how you're running right now. Damn, I'm, I'm brave. I don't got Larry or, or none of them to help me out. Uh, I see how you're doing it. You're, you're bringing up the combo fighting now. Uh huh. I, I I see how you're rolling now here. <laughs> hey, we need to shut down my stream and go get go join my backup. <laughs> Let them pull you up on panel and give you help. And you know that's at Raiden's Dickens. I just thought about that. I have been on my panel. You know yourself, right? I don't hardly have any problem at all. Other than in there at the first, right or wrong. I don't know, but I, I'm, I'm starting to think you, you, you want to see me do some kung fu fighting again. I'm very good to see Larry in them. <laughs> Stop it. Go. All right, let's go. Psycho Sasquatch isn't even, isn't even in here to help me out no more. All right. Well, close it out then. Well, any last final words, co-host? Well, yes. Thank you for having me. Um, thank you for everyone that came out. I hope you enjoyed the stream, whoever's all in here. I can't see the numbers, but thank you whoever came in. Okay, appreciate it. Uh, we did have some fun. We did go and see some Native American history. Um, and thank you, co uh, host, for having me on your panel. 
Uh, I appreciate it. Till next time. Thank you, guys. Peace. No problem, co-host. Thank you for joining me and helping me out with my panel. Um, he kung fu fighting. I remember that. Yeah, now you speak up, Romans. I said it was kung fu fighting. Romans. <laughs> 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 anyway, thanks for joining us. I hope you've enjoyed it. And all of those who watch my rewrite, I hope y'all enjoyed it as well. I sure wish y'all could have joined us. Yeah, thanks, thanks for, Roman. And God thanks bless you. Good night. Thank you, Roman, for bringing out the Kung Fu fighting again. Thank you so much. God bless. Peace out, folks. <clears throat> Ciao. Now you guys.